Hi, this is Larry Stewart with 4 at uh, IQ 2011 in Louisville. I'm in the Vermeer booth with Tony Briggs, who's uh, director of underground at Vermeer. Um, Tony, I understand that uh, Vermeer's gotten into the, the rock drilling business uh, with a couple of new products, a couple of new technologies. Why don't you tell us a little bit yeah, about them? Absolutely. We're, we're very excited uh, to be introducing two new platforms at the Louisville show, uh, IQ, this year. We're, the first one that we'll be introducing is our dirty D36 by 50 uh, DR. It's a dual rod system. Our second platform that we're bringing to market is an industry first. It is the D36x50R mag drilling system. Yeah, that mag drilling system, that really is a, a different kind of technology, a, a, an electromagnet, or uh, I'm sorry, magnetic uh, yes. uh, hammer in that, that machine. Yeah, absolutely. It's, it's an industry first source. So we are incorporating uh, you know, kind of the, the secret under the hood, if you will, is the, the different magnet technology that has opposing polarity that allows the drill string to uh, percussion or pulse uh, down at the down at the face of the bit. Yeah, what does the the magnetic um, aspect of that hammer offer over, say, an air hammer? Well, the the ability it gives it higher higher rate of frequency, so you can hit the face um, more often, higher higher beats per minute. Mm -hmm. um, and actually, we have a rheostat dial within uh, the operator's cabin that allows you to change the hertz or the output of how fast you're hitting it. So, dependent upon your formation and what sort of bit that you may have on the end of the drill string, you can actually adapt it to receive optimal production. Oh, okay. That's interesting. And uh, another of the advantages that, of that machine, as I understand, is that it, it, it truly is kind of a, a, a multi-terrain uh, uh, kind, of, kind of piece of equipment. What is it about that machine that makes it flexible enough to deal with yeah. rock, soil, et cetera, yeah. et cetera? Absolutely. So if you're drilling in a rock formation, obviously you have the adaptability of the different bits that you may put on it, as well as the changing of the frequency of how, how often you want to hit it. But you also, with the push of a button, have the ability to actually turn off the, the percussive system or the magnum drilling system and then you just go back to a, a standard 3650 drilling system that's proven out in the marketplace, used often, you have your, your dirt face bits, your trichome bits, um, or your, your uh, different bits that you can utilize through the different rock formations, through different dirt formations, clay, caliche, whatever it is, mm -hmm. and you can change on or off with the press of a button. And those are uh, rare earth magnets in that in that uh, uh, hammer, which means you're not actually sending power down the down the stem. Is that true? That is that is true. Okay. So with the opposing the opposing polarity actually makes makes the drill string pulsate down. We also then have airbag incorporated into the back of the mag drilling system that eliminates any vibration from going back up into the gearbox or into the the drill itself. Oh, okay. So it's concentrated at the bit. I see. All right. And the, the point that you made earlier, I think, is one that, that uh, we, we should make sure is, is clear, is that these machines, uh, in terms of thrust and pullback and a, a lot of those features, are very much like the, the original uh, HDD machines that are you know, still in the, the Vermeer line, Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. The D36 by 50 Series 2 is a staple in our product line. It's one of our most proven, most popular drill systems that we have out there. Mm -hmm. And we utilize that same platform both on our dual rod system as well as our magnum drilling system. And the dual rod system has some interesting, uh, unique characteristics um, co compared to what, what's on the market today. Why don't right. you tell us a little bit, bit about more about that? Yeah, so the, the heart of the machine is actually what happens down holes. So the inner rod that we actually have is the true inner rod, so it allows fluid passage to go down uh, to the tricone bit that we have at the front. We have 1,500 foot-pounds of torque at the bit and we have the ability to flow mud down through the inner drill string as well as outside of that uh, drill string inside of the outer rod. Mm -hmm. So we're excited about the capabilities to have uh, full mud at the bit, which really isn't so much needed during the pilot bore, but very critical during the pullback to have the full 70 gallon per minute that we have on the machine available for your back ring. Oh, okay, I see. And. Uh uh, the makeup on, on that pipe is also uh, unique to Vermeer, is that correct? Yeah, absolutely. We actually have, it's a, it's, a, it's a dual thread, so we will thread up our inner rod 
and then bring the second or the outer rod down and actually have a dual thread system. We've incorporated a three vice system, so it gives you that functionality. We've also added full automation if you so desire, so that you can automate that rod makeup sequence. Once you get proficient with the operation, then you can manually override it and do it yourself. Oh, okay. Well, that, must, that must speed the, the training process for new Absolutely. It's a, it gives the operator a chance to watch the sequence. What has to happen is he goes through. As he gets more comfortable with the operation of the machine, he can, he can obviously override it and do it himself. I see. When are these machines available? Are they, are they now available yeah. now? or? We're actually, during our, our, our prototype phase, we're doing a pilot rollout where we will actually be drilling the rocks or, or util, utilizing the machine to drill in different rock formation throughout the country so we get some different geological formations so we feel more comfortable in suggesting the appropriate bit mm -hmm. for what we'll be using and then in the springtime we'll get into full production. I see, okay. Well, it's a, a real interesting product and I look forward to finding out uh, what, you, what you all find out between now and, uh, and production time. Absolutely, Thanks, we're very Tom. excited about it. Thanks for the time, Larry. Sure thing.